Hi, my name is Fabien and I want to make a little video about the vice I use and the tools I use to tie my flies. I receive a lot of questions what, what's the material I use and maybe with this video I can answer some of the questions you have asked me in the past. So the first part is um, the tools and after that the device with all the different possibility. The device I use is the stone for transformer that I have here and we will have a look on, uh, on them why I use this one. So I'm sorry for my bad English so please understand that's not my first language so I try to do my best. Thank you and enjoy the video. For me this is this one that I make on the fire place here at home and normally it have this form but I I make it because to because it's very strong and because it helped me to have the right form on the the big my flies the Vulgata or um, Danica or yeah so this one is an important tools so just hit something here and lit little bit after a little bit you can have the the right form another one tool that I make and is very cheap and everyone have it this is a big you take out everything also this part and this will help you to to take together the thing you under the hook you you can go in in the hook like that and press everything together and you can still tie. So you have it also to um, to push things like that or push the this way. So this help this is not the best stucker because you see I use it a lot but to stack the um, the air this one is the one I use because you have the for the small smaller hooks and for bigger hooks and you have the possibility also to to change it here and it changed the um, the size so the other one is in a air stacker bobbin treader um this one tweezer and this one is also a very important for people that uh, used to tie uh, deer hair or uh, it, it's very easy to clean the other fur under fur and on the other side you have the velcro to push out the dubbing of the salmon fry So, to the scissor, I use mostly the the three one, one groove and two with a straight blade. So the groove one, this is the big biggest one, but it it have a fantastic groove to make the the modeler uh, flies, the, the, the modeler head, the um, bomber and everything that have deer hair. The two other one, this is a smaller one with big loops to take a hin in your hand and still you can tie. And the other one, the little one 
is when you need to come in tiny tiny places so this is the the tools that I use mostly and with this tool and some bobbins you have almost everything a tweezer is not to to forget so now we can go on the second part and I will present you the device that I use every day estos eran un poco las herramientas que utilizo y con esto se puede se puede hacer casi todo tipo de moscas son las cosas más importantes y no hace falta mucho más que eso para poder montar moscas bueno ahora voy a cambiar la... vamos a ir a la próxima sección que les voy a enseñar un poco cómo es el aparatito primero esa parte y después miramos el resto now this is the the part of the vase to to show you this part here and afterwards we we take the the rest so this one here i use it for a smaller hook dry flies until uh, the smallest hooks you can uh, think and it's very easy to take a hook and it's very very strong so um, that I like here is this part also because if you tie something and you have a wire this just to come hit here and it holds in this one so it's very easy to do it so the other possibility that is you have rotary function it's very easy to to use it and very important when you tie to see the other side or this side is everything okay so this part is the best one you are finished to tie dry flies but you want to tie streamer now so you have the the streamer the streamer uh, part you have also in this part the possibility to to take the one for the tube this is extra material but if you have it it's very easy to to use together you have also the possibility to tie tube flies and to change the with the different tubes and everything so it's very easy to to use it and very quick and like i said i have tied thousands and thousands of flies on them and it's still working like new so this is what i I have to this part and now we can we will to see the next one okay the next part is the base the base is very very heavy so this is very good to tie with because it don't move in any place so you can work easily and don't have no problem that it move or something if, if you tie videos or I, I don't know or um, you have the possibility to order also the, the toolbar for to make your your tools and on the same base is a lot of place to take um, different different um, tools so you have also the possibility to to go up and down um, 
to have some materials that you use the the hooks that you use to to tie and you have the possibility also to work with um, this one you can have it on this way and hold and tie and hold uh, everything here or the other way that is power loop and just have it in the, the same place here and just hold the hockey here and for the thread and for the thread there you have the two the two possibilities so this very easy also to um, to build everything together so this is why I use this vice I hope you enjoy the video and maybe you let me know if you like it or not or again I'm sorry for my bad English bueno eso era la video so la, la pequeña película espero que les gustó son unas de las herramientas que utilizo y después de recibir muchas veces preguntas de qué utilizo pues le quería hacer esto Muchísimas gracias y déjame un comentario si le gustó o no o, y si le gustaría que haga otras cosas hablando. Muchísimas gracias. Thank you very much.